Hi everyone, welcome to the 9-11 Blacklist with myself, Lee Apted. The footage which you're actually watching right now is the complete and unabridged version of the United 93 crash footage which I've had for quite some time and many people always ask me about. Basically, it, what does it show? It shows, it shows a crater. It shows a crater in uh, Shanksville, in Pennsylvania, and pretty much nothing else. And I think that is a huge reason for this. So many researchers over the years have used uh, this footage, not all of it, admittedly, but used certain aspects of the footage to show basically that there's nothing going on. Now, when uh, it, the actual footage does take the air, you'll see what I mean. All you actually see is the, sh the actual vague shape of a plane um, in, in this crater, and you don't see anything else. The, um, the, the FBI used this footage. They used the fact that uh, they actually found evidence in the crater of the black box. They used evidence uh, of a singed bandana you found they they showed in their evidence bag that they showed um, singed passports as well one of them being CC Lyles as well who actually had that famed piece of uh, audio which have been on previous episodes of the 9-11 blacklist where she said possibly it's a frame or, well, I think, or you did great. And then even after that, says, sorry, or it depends on your interpretation of it. Okay, we're, go we're, gonna we're taken to the air now, so you can see the uh, helicopter footage uh, from, from which that my opening of the 9-11 blacklist, some of it anyway, did actually come from. Uh, this is rather remarkable because what they actually this is obviously before the memorial uh, and really took place but when you actually look at the uh, supposed crater where this uh, where well where the United 93 is um, allegedly supposed to have crashed it's um, it's remarkable that there is nothing there now People who um, still vote for the 9-11 Commission report and say that it's all fully factual will tell us that it's an abandoned strip mine. And indeed, if you look on Wikipedia, that's what they still say, that it's an abandoned strip mine. And basically, the plane inverted as it was plummeting towards the ground, uh, way past its uh, VMO, or Vehicle Max Operating Speed, and actually inverted and and went into the earth and if you can believe that and that's why you don't see any of the plane basically the ground swallowed it up if you can believe that but like I did say if it's going past its vehicle max operating speed surely the plane would have it inverted as well the wings would have come off things like that would have happened way before it even hit the ground. Now, when you actually look at that footage, as I'm showing it to you now, it is really quite strange. Can you get it logically into your head that a plane is inside what you're looking at? You see, when you actually look at it just on very basic, simple um, ideas like that, it's quite hard to grasp, isn't it? So... I just thought that I'd give you this footage, prepare this footage, and just give you this footage to watch, and then, and then just leave you. And when I leave you now, just think to yourselves, does that crater look like it can house um, United 93, where nothing is there, no wreckage is showing, and yet the FBI somehow found on their documentary, they showed us, 
the black box and other evidence. Do you really believe that story? I'll leave that up to you. I'm out of here. Ta-da for now.